What up, people? Thanks for coming back to the channel. This is Straight Bearded, and I'm Rob. Uh, in Straight Bearded, we talk about beard products. I give you some reviews and my thoughts on them. We also sometimes talk about tips and tricks on maintaining your beard, uh, things that work for me, and hopefully they'll work for you. Uh, but today I'm coming to you to talk to you a little bit about a company out of New York called Untamed Beards. This is a relatively new company uh, run by a gentleman by the name of Nick. One man show, small batch company, uh, but it seems like he's, he's definitely on the right track. Uh, but I just recently had purchased... Uh, the be his his beard balm and beard oil in the scent of the Gatsby. So we're going to go ahead and look at that, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and tell you what I thought of it. All right, let's get down to business. But before we do, I want to go ahead and give uh, thanks to all the small batch companies out there that are absolutely killing it on the regular. Uh, in your spare time, you're putting together product, uh, sales, websites, uh, you're taking care of DMs, messages, questions. That's not anything you can get from a big batch company, and I truly do appreciate that, which is why I'm pretty much, for the most part, going to stay with the flow of the small batch company. Thank you all so much for what you do, and I appreciate you. Uh, now, Untamed Beards is also a small, small batch company. Like I said, they're out of New York uh, and run by a gentleman by the name of Nick, which is already proven to be super responsive. Uh, now, there's something that I, I've had this product for a few days now, and I pretty much wanted to do a review right away, but I've, I forced myself to wait. Uh, I wanted to make sure that I got this product in my beard for several days to make sure that, that, that I'm good to go and that I completely understand and I can, I'm able to give you an honest review of the product and its performance. Before I go into the performance uh, information on the, the bomb and the oil, I want to talk about un Untamed Beard shipping. Um, now, I ordered my product on a very, very early Monday morning. It was Sunday night, Monday morning, and I'd say Monday 1 a.m.-ish. Uh, got on the site, placed my order, figured, okay, I'll see it in a week. Uh, you know, that's, that's kind of the general thing. Um, was very, very shocked after ordering around mo Monday 1 a.m. to wake up to an email at 7 a.m. the same morning, uh, letting me know that my shipping, my, my, uh, the label's been created and my, my order's been processed. I said, okay, well, that, okay, well, he's, he's definitely on it. Maybe I caught him in a good cycle. And I figured that would be the end of that and it would be another week. Well, lo and behold, later that day, I got notification that it had already shipped out and left the post office. This is Monday. I just ordered it less than eight hours prior, but maybe 10 hours prior. Um, Anyhow, long story short, with no additional shipping that I requested or anything, I received that same product ordered Monday morning on Wednesday morning from New York, and I'm in North Carolina. So, two days, bro? Wow. And on top of it, he offers free shipping. I mean, I don't know anybody in the game that could beat that. I hope that that continues, because boy, is that good for business. But my guy, I felt like I had Amazon Prime on a local small batch company. It's crazy. So know that if you order from them, you're not going to be waiting. I, I hope that things don't change and I hope that doesn't make me a lie, but boy, for me, it was phenomenal. Had the stuff instantly right away. Now, let me go ahead and get to this awesome, awesome bomb and oil. Like I said, I picked up the scents of Gatsby uh, in, in the bomb and oil, and I'll, I'll show you these labels one more time. So love that vintage look. Love that vintage look. Let me see if I can get you to look. Oh, look at that. Yeah, I love that vintage look. Um, now, as far as the bottles, both of them are glass. No plastic here. I love that. Um, the one thing that I'll tell you, I believe it's going to be the one thing that I may say that's not completely positive, is I am not a fan of that dropper type. I'm not a fan. And I know before I had ordered, they had options to where you can either get a pump or this type. Uh, I'm, I'm just not a fan of this particular type. Um it's not a big deal whatsoever. I can still get the oil out and I can still get it in the quantities that I want. It's just something I'm not accustomed to, but I'll get used to it because what's inside this bottle is phenomenal. Now the Gatsby, uh, is a, is in the scent of sandalwood and espresso. Um, I wasn't quite sure about it cause I'm not really, I'm not really sure about coffee scents, but I took a chance. I absolutely love coffee. Don't get me wrong. I must have coffee in mass quantities every day just to keep me from choking people. Sorry, it's what it is. Don't want to choke people out. Um, but this actually helps with that. So right out of the bottle, I was a little bit surprised 
that uh, when I first got it out of out of the mailbox, I opened it, opened it right up, and the oil right out of the bottle, excuse me, had a very very light scent. I couldn't hardly smell it. Uh, that completely changed, of course, when I got it out of the bottle. Um, now this this coffee is not like a it's not like a black coffee. It's not like a dark coffee. From what I understand, um, Nick is infusing uh, roasted coffee beans in with the argon oil, and I'll put the uh, I'll put all the ingredients of his oils over here. Um, but he's he's infusing actual coffee beans in with this, and that's really that's really awesome. I didn't know that that was something that could be done, but it's a nice touch, and it really does pay off in the scent. Now the scent of this is about one of the most pleasing that I have. Now I've got some favorites out there, but I do believe that the Gatsby has just slipped right there at the number one spot, right there close to it. I still haven't found out. I want to give it a little bit more time to know exactly where it sits and, and where it's going to live with me. But this scent is just so pleasing. That coffee uh, just permeates and it lasts throughout the day. Um, now his oil is it's, it's going to be difficult to show you. Let me see if I can show you at least on my hand just the color of that oil. And it is, it's a, it's actually a medium weight oil. It ran kind of quick. Um, but I hate to have wasted any of that. So let me just lightly throw some in there. I've already got it all up in it. Um, but that oil, it just, it permeates. Once you get it in beard, it permeates your beard throughout the day. Really, really good uh, hydrating properties. Catches my skin, uh, makes my skin feel really, really good. Love that oil. Love that scent. It lasts a good long time. Uh, and it feels very distinguished. It's, it's very sophisticated smell. Um, now onto the bomb. Uh, I wasn't too sure because I've not had a holding bomb of this caliber yet. Uh, so I kind of played with it a lot. I, I'd, I'd put some in, uh, put a specific amount in, wash it back out. I just kind of play with the products uh, throughout the day. It's never just a an in once and then wear it and then go. I, I'll, I'll kind of mess with them and see how they how they treat me as far as holding everything is concerned uh, and the amount that I should use. Uh, but the Gatsby uh, in the in the bomb is a medium hold, if not a medium to stronger hold. It's definitely the strongest one I've got now, and I appreciate that. And I had to learn how to use a stronger holding bomb. Um, now, nice glass jar, lovely label, vintage look. Uh, it's got like a caramel. I'm not sure what color that is, but I love that color. Uh, so I've got, got a pick here. I'm going to show you because it's a little bit more difficult to get out, uh, with your finger. Um, but I'll show you what it's, what I'm doing with a pick here. So got my trusty dusty pick. It's really easy to get out. Really good consistency bomb. Um, Emulsifies very, very quick. It's very, very creamy. Uh, really, really good. Really good feel. Really light feel in your beard, actually. So a couple things I learned about the bomb is um, day one, uh, when I first tried it, I uh, I put just a, just a small amount in because it just, as soon as you warm that up in your hands and you smell it, it's, it's a great smell and it lasts so long. I think I've said that, but it's worth saying it again. It lasts so long throughout the night from the morning. Um, but putting this in my beard, I, I did my very first day with it, uh, just a really, really light coating throughout my beard. Um, and I did something a little, little bit different where I, I wanted to style up and out and give myself some more fullness. And I've done that before, before with a couple other products, and they just didn't hold throughout the day. Everything kind of just kind of fell. Gravity took over. Um, but the Gatsby in this bomb, in this hold bomb, kept me up and full throughout the day. Couldn't believe it. Very, very little need for touch-ups unless I bump something. Um, but when I did touch up, I would, uh, for me, I would brush up just to give that fullness and then brush back down and the fullness just stayed throughout the day. And that was something I didn't expect. So that's a really, really good plus for me. Uh, since then I've, I've tried, uh, a double amount to see just how much hold and how much lock I can get into my beard. And it does its job. It absolutely does its job. So in regards to Gatsby, the scent phenomenal, uh, the bomb the bomb is probably definitely my number one right now. Uh, absolutely for hold. Um, I, I don't feel that I'm getting very much conditioning out of it. I'm sure it's in there, but with using the co-washes and everything, it's really hard to pull it out unless you just lock down to one product. But uh, this bomb and what, whatever he's got in here, and again, on this bomb, I'll put, I'll put the ingredients over here for you. Um, I absolutely love this bomb and oil. And I can't wait till I get enough under my belt to where I can do a top three, top five. Because I can promise you, 
I absolutely promise you, this is definitely going to be in the top three. Uh, so if you've got any questions about about this uh, this company, this bomb, this oil, go to the website, reach out to Nick. He's a, he's an open book. The uh, the pricing on this for this oil for a one ounce oil is eight ninety nine on the website, which I think is just phenomenal. That's like Dollar General prices with you know Saks Fifth Avenue type quality. Um, he's got two different sizes in the bomb. He's got a uh, a, a two ounce tin and a four or two ounce tin and a four ounce glass jar. Uh, the two ounce is, if I'm not mistaken, $14.99, uh, and the four ounce is $22.99. A phenomenal deal. Definitely going to be doing business with him again in the future, and I highly recommend that you do. Uh, please don't miss this one. Whether you think you like coffee or not, don't let that deter you. This is a very, very sophisticated scent that hangs with you throughout the day. If you're outside or even inside under a ceiling fan or something, and that, that breeze catches and it throws it right in your nose, Boy, that's such a treat, and I really do love it. Uh, I think I've become an over-enthusiast, almost obsessed with beard products and, and what they can do for me, and I want to impart that to you. Guys, thanks for your time. I really appreciate you coming to the channel. If you haven't done so, please go ahead and subscribe, like this video, and comment on it. I love the comment section. I love to hear any type of suggestions. As a matter of fact, if you've got any suggestions of things you'd like to see, uh, anything you want to see me change, I'd love to do a different background back here at some point in time, but really it's just a, a really comfortable setting uh, where I just want to talk to some folks about beard products. That's it. Nothing major, nothing professional, nothing enough. Just a, just me talking to a few cats out there uh, in the internet, in the Weber, in the Weber world. Anyhow, y'all thanks. I appreciate your time. Like, comment, subscribe. Y'all boys take care of your beards now. Take care of your beards. Have a great one.